Hey, if you picked up a brand new Vivo Smart 4 and you're trying to get it paired and connected to your smartphone using the Garmin Connect mobile app, well, watch this video. I'm going to walk you through the pairing process using the Garmin Connect mobile app and an iOS device. But keep an eye out. I'll have a future video with the pairing process for the Vivo Smart 4 and an Android device because some of the steps are a little bit different. But either way, at least you'll have a good guidance. So let's get connected. All right, before you can pair your Vivo Smart 4 to the Garmin Connect mobile app and your iOS device, you'll need to download the app. Here I've already downloaded the app, but I'm gonna walk you through the process. I've gotten in my hand an iPad that I've been using to pair it, so we're gonna go through this together. First you'll wanna do is open the App Store. After you open the App Store, you're gonna to wanna to search for Garmin Connect. And here I have it at the top, I'm gonna to select Garmin Connect. From here, I'm going to either tap the word get or open. In this case, as I mentioned before, I've already downloaded the app, so the word open is next to it. However, if I haven't, here, you'll see the word get next to one of these apps. You'll tap it. Once it's downloaded, you'll go back to your homepage and you'll have the Garmin Connect mobile app on your screen. Tap it to begin the process. All right, let's get started here. The first thing I wanna do is choose a language. Now, in some cases, the screen may be black or blank. If it is, just double tap the screen and it'll wake. In this case, we're gonna choose a language by tapping the screen and I'm gonna choose English. That's my preferred language, selected. Now it says searching for Garmin Connect Mobile. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and if I'm a new user, I'm gonna tap the circle with the plus symbol in the top right hand corner on the Garmin Connect mobile app. And there, it already found it. All we have to do is start by tapping connect it. It's gonna give me a pairing code. The code appears on the screen of the watch. In this case, it's the Bluetooth pairing request 815-465. And then I'm gonna tap pair. All right, I want to allow the iPad notifications. I'm going to put this as my primary tracker. And the process is working up. Setup complete, hit next. And here I can answer a few quick questions. I typically go to bed around nine. And I typically wake up about five. Next. Uh, the do not disturb setting lets you turn off notifications during your sleep window. Would you like to turn it on? Yes, I don't wanna be disturbed when I'm sleeping. I wear it on my left arm, hit next. I'm gonna choose the standard screen here. I could make some different selections, but for this case, I'm gonna use the standard screen. It tells me it's 1010, the M stands for Monday, a T would stand for Tuesday, and the number next to it stands for the date. So we're gonna hit next. And it could set up some goals, but I'm gonna go ahead and skip for now. And then I'm gonna tap sync to get the sync process complete. And that's it, I'm all finished, I hit finish. And we can try some simple gestures to get this device working. But since this is just a pairing video, we're gonna skip for now. Skip. And I'm all finished and all set up. And congratulations on your new Vivo Smart 4. We can go through some basic settings, but for this process, we're gonna hit not now. And we can revisit that when we are ready. So we got it. All right, that's it. The Vivo Smart 4 is now paired and connected. And here we got the screen is blank, so we're gonna double tap the screen and it illuminates there. And you can see the time, the T for Tuesday, the day's the 28th. And I can tap that little bar to bring the menu up and I can swipe up or down 
to go through this menu. I can tap the bar again to go back. This little gray bar at the bottom is what I'm referring to right there. You can tap it and it opens a menu for you. And it's also your back button. I can choose an activity, a walk, or a run. But in this case, it's all set. It's working the way I want it. It's paired and connected to the Garmin Connect mobile app. And that's it. That's the steps to get the Vivo Smart 4 paired and connected to the Garmin Connect mobile app using an iOS device. This can be an iPhone, an iPad, iPad mini, any of those. But keep in mind, you only want to pair your Vivo Smart 4 to one smart device. So only pair it with your smartphone or only pair it with your iPad. Now, if you don't have an iPhone or an iPad, there is another method to get your Vivo Smart 4 connected, and that's using Garmin Express on a Windows or Mac computer. We'll visit that one on the next video, so keep an eye out. Again, I'm Nick with Tech Me Nick. I hope we got you connected.